I make a commitment to you, says the Lord, that I will not let the evil steal your midterm elections. Lord says that I'm going to take angels and I'm going to stick them in every precinct and I'm going to stop this subterry that they've been pulling. I'm going to stop this sneakiness and when they think they're headed over there, God said, I will stop them for the Lord says, I make a covenant with you that this is an above election. So in continuing to stand in opposition of these false prophets, we want to document this in a video in hopes, uh, in the hopes that some followers of these false prophets will awaken and come away from them. Because honestly, you can't make this stuff up. Here is Ken Christmas strutting with all arrogance up and down the stage as though he owns the world. wanting you to, to believe that he has all the authority of Jesus Christ flowing through him. And he says, hey folks, God says he's going to make a commitment to you. He's committing to you that these elections will not be stolen by the evil. And just so you really believe me, I'm going to put angels at all the precincts. We're going to make double sure. And he's saying God said this. This will be an election from above. Meaning that God has got all the exits blocked. Everything's locked up. It will happen. What happened, Kent? Well, as of right now, and today is November 13th. The Democrats own the majority in the Senate. What Kent said was going to happen didn't happen, which means that God did not speak this. This came from the vain imagination of a narcissistic, fraudulent prophet. Here it is. And again, I, I think it's fitting. You've got star power here. You know, there's Dog the Bounty Hunter watching Kent strut up and down the stage. That didn't help. Dog is probably just thinking, you know, where's my paycheck? Let me get out of here. So again, as I wrap this up, we just want to document this. And our, our prayers are out for the followers that... God Almighty would remove the delusion that he would remove the scales from your eyes. These men, these women who call themselves prophets, who are verified many times over as falsely prophesying, they are not of God. They are the opposite. They do not preach the gospel of Jesus Christ. They preach Donald Trump. They preach nationalism. So please awaken and come away from these false prophets.